we're going to be looking at the staircase problem on Hacker Inc. The staircase problem expects us to create a function that will take some integer n as an argument. This integer n will represent the height or the amount of stairs that our staircase should consist of. We can also see that the width is the same as the height when considering the spaces. Each stair is represented by a pound sign or hash symbol and is right aligned by spaces. We can see in this example we are to consider a staircase of size n equals 4. The staircase begins with one pound symbol and then increments in size by each line until finally our last line is filled with n pound symbols. So let's go ahead and get started with the solution. To prevent using nested for loops, we're going to go ahead and just use the built-in string builder class. We can begin by creating a for loop. This will go ahead and build out each stair. So we'll do int i equals one. And we're gonna start at one because we want our first line to have one step in it with a width of one. And since we're starting at one, we want to do less than or equal than n. And inside of our for loop, we want to create a new string builder object and we're going to name that step. And we're going to initialize this new string builder object uh, as an empty string. So we'll do string.empty. Now we can go ahead and begin appending to our new string builder object. Uh, since it's right aligned, we're going to begin with spaces. So we'll handle that first. Uh, we'll do step.append. Now the first argument that append is going to take is going to be the character that we want to append to it. And the second argument is going to be the amount of that character that we want to append. Now, since we're talking about the spaces, we need a way to represent this. And we could represent this as n minus the current iteration we're on. So we can do n and we'll do minus i. So to visualize how that works, um, let's say that we have a staircase of size n equals four. n is the amount of steps that we are to have in our staircase. And for the first iteration, which is gonna be iteration, iteration one, it'll be four minus one, which is three. That gives us three spaces. And for the second iteration, it's going to be four minus two, which is two spaces, and so on. Next, we need to handle the stair itself. So we'll do step.append, and we are to use hash signs for this. So we'll do the pound symbol there. And then this is just going to be the iteration that we're currently on. So for iteration one, we're gonna have one, iteration two, we're gonna have two, and iteration three, we're gonna have three, and so on. So the last thing that we need to do is we need to print this out for each iteration. So we'll do console.write line and we're just gonna print out the step. So let's go ahead and run this and see how it works. So the first test case passed, uh, we'll go ahead and submit and see how they all do. And they're all good, so I hope that helped you.